Uh oh, the amazing start went last game and now it looks like it could be, it could be getting worse. Down TV versus Dwarves. Fraction Jackson. He, at least he hasn't got so much guard. He spelled Dimmy wrong. <laughs> Dimmy the Dimwit. One, two, three, four. Only four guard for 1790. That's good. For me, not for him. Oh, and 100k of his is money. So 100k of his TV is bloat. That's nice, isn't it? Slibly. Slibly and a wizard. Yes, please. It was alright, which got. It was actually alright. Like, obviously, I'm terrible, you know, and it's on really low level and that, but, uh, and I don't know any of the rules of baseball. But it was quite fun hitting home runs very occasionally. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't very really able to hit one runs or anything. Like, I wasn't able to. Like when I every time I hit the ball, I was either out or a home run. But um, it was it was kind of fun. I'll play it again. Hello, Satatod. Le Blizzard. We 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 shall kick this. He is saying Frosty. Does he know that Frosty is here? We do not want the uh, short hands on the defense. No, no, no. Where's the strength, dude? Over oh, there. Yeah, Satterfield against Charles just kicked fuck out of us, sadly. What about that? That's got to be better, hasn't it? Should have gone one forward, maybe. We've just realised. Never fuck in mind. Yeah, the uh, it was a hard loss against Chorfs. <laughs> it was funny, Satterfield. The guy who had got plus movement attempted two one-turn touchdowns, and uh, not only did he fail fail them both, um, he died on the second one. So on another day, it could have easily been a win or a draw, but um, wasn't to be. Not the end of the world. 1% effort. No one cares. Can you hear the game sounds, by the way? Could turn it up a bit. Maybe not. Maybe that's okay. No, oh, I haven't added ever on the Discord, have I? What a dickhead. Oh, no more, no more fucking thing. Good bit of English there. No more Blizzard.
We had enough one, yeah. Hello, Lamont. Hello, Kiwi. Fuck's sake, Tony, stop being shit. Glorious. No, I won't give me Glorious. In until I'm victorious. And I will defend. I will defend. Thank you very much, Kiwi. Do you know what? Maybe I should put text to speech back on. And hope people. People stop being cunts. That, you just did it the other day, didn't you? But you are. Uh, <laughs> wasn't it? Wasn't that, isn't that the one that. Isn't that from like just the other day? But thanks anyway. <laughs> Did I say it? Did I say oh, I said the C word, didn't I? Oh, God. I said it myself, hoping that people wouldn't say it. I said it myself. <laughs> Fuck's sake. I like how he's put all these guys in, then he's realised it's not so easy. Yup. The Dubler GFI for maybe a one day. Maybe an uphill. Oh no, he's only one hit. Oh, derp. Fucking derp. Yeah, maybe I do. If you want to be part of Team Positive, then uh, you've got to fucking suck it up. Stop bitching like a little baby and try and fucking play better, eh? Nay. God, maybe I should fight him all. What, what the fuck is he doing? <laughs> what the fuck is this? I've never seen even Space Cadet protect the ball this badly. That's a lie, but it's pretty bad, isn't it? I can follow, right? Because we've both got an assist. Because I've got guard. Now I'd rather move other people in. Could try and uh... <laughs> that was incredible, wasn't it? Of course it is. Fuck me. Honestly, what is even the point of playing blood ball? This is why I lose to fucking space cadet every time, man. <laughs> this is literally there's literally no need for this shit how can you be that bad and then not even get punished in fact sucks a reroll away from me for no fucking reason Horrible, isn't it? Fucking horrible. What horrible, 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 horrible play. And what's the outcome? I lose a reroll. Maybe I shouldn't have rerolled it. I didn't have to reroll it because obviously it'll give us better chances. So I shouldn't have rerolled it. Okay, my bad. Learn from playing space today. Shouldn't have rerolled it. It's all my fault. My bad play that I lost a reroll, isn't it? There you go. Likes <sighs> the GFIS, doesn't he?
Hmm. Of course he does. Oh, I'm getting pissed off. Because of course it would be. Like I just can't handle people being this shit. I just, I just can't. I can't handle it, man. I can't handle playing against Space Cadet. I can't handle playing against this guy. I just, why? What? What are you even playing at? Like it's just stupid, isn't it? It's just stupid. It's like, what the fuck is he doing, man? What the fuck is he actually doing? It's hard. It's hard to take, isn't it? What on earth is he fucking doing? <laughs> I'll tell you what I'm gonna be doing. Fucking pushing. Jesus. <laughs> Push it real good. Like, what's the point, though, isn't it? It's like, why is it even a game? I don't know. It's hard to take, isn't it? It's hard to take that you can... That you can literally... Like, I'm not saying that I'm playing perfect this game, but you could play completely perfectly, and somebody could literally just mash their fucking fingers off the keyboard and still beat you. That's, like, hard to... Hard to keep your motivation for a game like that going, isn't it? He loves going for the fucking skinks, doesn't he? One percent. Allez les gars, tous ensemble. Hello, Uncle Sherman. Thanks. Yeah, real fun. I've had a lot of fun doing this. Dove, 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 dove. It's made be it's been made a lot worse by the fact I'm wearing headphones. I just can't be bothered to go at the hassle of changing them. <laughs> yeah, it looks like it, didn't it, squirrel dude? Lizards versus dwarves. For the millionth time ever. Oh man, I'm 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 distraught about Blood Bowl 2020 now with no time limit. Especially given the room. Well, the guy who's claimed he's involved, the guy who is self, he, he he's either self broken an NDA or self claimed he's under an NDA that he's breaking. Yeah, that's what he's doing. Isn't he? but considering the guy who has self proclaimed that he's broken his DNA, NDA. Even, the guy who has self-proclaimed he has broken his NDA. That's correct. That's correct. Given who that is, he'd probably be like, No! Have unlimited turns. <laughs> or four. Yeah. Oh, for fuck's sake. The one who wanted to rig the ball on turn times to advantage himself. He's certainly going to want long turn times, isn't he? Well, at least to put a tail on the ball, eh? That was worth it. <sighs> Did 
didn't want to make it he had for me to hit the ball, so he just did that. <laughs> Fuck off, man. What is, what is this shit? I genuinely can't handle it. Oh, of course it's a push. Oh, actually, power that guy. Yeah, so maybe he's just fucking talking out of his ass. Who knows? He's breaking. An, he's either breaking an NDA or he's talking out of his ass, which neither would surprise me. Coming from somebody like that. I mean, he's alright at Blood Bowl, isn't he? He's certainly not as good as he thinks he is. Had any good dreams recently? Oh god, last night I dreamt I was, uh, I was in like a, it wasn't a good dream. I dreamt I was in like a, you know, some kind of post-apocalyptic wasteland. And I was, I was hiding out in some kind of a, you know, I don't know, like a warehouse kind of thing. And there was a, <laughs> There was a girl who was like a, a fucking, uh, this is a really obtuse reference, but it's who it was. If, if you haven't know, if you don't know who she is, you weren't a kid in the, uh, you, you aren't my age in England, basically. And even then, she was a page three stunner. She wasn't a stunner, she was ugly as fuck. Page three stunner, um, Lindsay Dawn McKenzie, but she had massive, massive massive jugs but she's uh she was really ugly and i was in bed with her which isn't the worst thing to happen in an apocalypse is it to be fair and then there were loads of other people like that i went to school with and stuff started turning up and they were all sleeping on the floor which i was quite happy that they didn't get in the bed um and yeah, and that and that was that was nothing much happened, but that that was that was it. <laughs> every block he's making is a pal. Just every single block. Every GFI is a pass. Every pickup's a, a success. Completely not protecting the ball at all. Just pure space cadetting it. Pure fucking space cadetting it. Good air, Cocky. Another movement, movement, fucking eight, movement six and eight, and seven, seven, six and eight dwarves, pretty good, aren't they? Let's go on the fifty-fifty of him just pushing it at completely the wrong square. Wouldn't have been surprised. But on fireball now I'm fucked on defense. I'm already kind of fucked being down two players, but I think now's the point where it's got it's now or never in it. Get in, just fucking nothing. Just absolutely fucking nothing. Oh. 
Another push. Another push. Bonehead or both down? Another two. No! Outrageous. No! Complete opposite. That was a disaster. Maybe I should have bolted. That's why you never fireball, isn't it, really? Right? Lesson learned. Never ever fireball ever again. No matter what the game state, what the payoff. <laughs> Never, ever, ever, ever fireball. <laughs> Pablo. <laughs> nah, because I wanted to take out, I wanted to knock down his edge forward for recovery, didn't I? That was my uh, that was my thinking. Maybe I was wrong, but that's what I wanted. <laughs> hey! Well, don't play like this guy. Whatever you do, <laughs> don't roll my don't roll like me, and don't play like him. <laughs> See, this is why I wanted to fireball in as well. He's just got the he's got the easy hand off, hasn't he? <sighs> That's why there's no point kind of either bolt neither of them because if I bolt him and then he just he just gets the ball off him, doesn't he? It's so fucking frustrating. It's mind boggling. Maybe I shouldn't have fireball. I sh no, I shouldn't have fireball. Of course, he was going to let me in in a horrific position. So it's my fault, maybe, oh god, he's fucked that up, hasn't he? Wow, that was terrible. Again, I don't know why, <laughs> I don't know why I'm surprised <laughs> that it was terrible, but, um, that was terrible. As was that. Right. God, this is a hard turn, isn't it? There's so many things I could do. Him being dodge makes him freeing people up a bit harder, doesn't it? to commit to two games a day no matter how I felt and then after not playing yesterday I thought I'll play it today and I didn't I wasn't I wasn't in a mood rusher to play it and <laughs> it hasn't helped that obviously 
<laughs> I've been diced by someone who is actually horrendous at Blood Bowl. That hasn't helped. Thanks, Crucifer, <laughs> and uh, welcome, welcome, Crucifer and Crucifer viewers to the absolute shit show that is uh, that is the worst war play you've ever seen in your life. Casually beating me, brilliant, <laughs> fucking brilliant. <sighs> I'm not being harsh to the guy. I'm not calling him an idiot. In fact, you're probably less of an idiot if you're shit at Blood Bowl than if you're good at Blood Bowl. I mean, I'm not really proud of how good I am at Blood Bowl, but it's got no impact on uh, <laughs> society at all, has it? Being good at Blood Bowl. So you're probably better off not being good at Blood Bowl, but this guy is fucking terrible. And it's pretty frustrating losing to him. Losing to somebody is terrible. Pretty annoying. On appelle ça le baiser de Nefel. Some would say it's an absolute Dyson. God, I hate having the headphones on as well. I'm going to sort this out. Fuck it. No more headphones. Fuck JFW. No, he's got fucking friend, hasn't he? <laughs> God. <laughs> he's got fucking fan. <laughs> I just hope I've got Juggernaut. Doesn't have Juggernaut. Yeah, been back for a bit, strobe, but um, never as unlucky as today. <laughs> this is something else, he space cadet at me. I don't know why I lose to space cadet level players, consistently as well. That seems to be the way to beat me, just, just give me the ball, give me fucking all the dice on your ball every single turn, and then somehow I'll not get the ball and you'll remove a bunch of players and win. It's fucking mental. I just, I just genuinely don't understand what it is. Space Cadet Magic. 
Of course he gets the removal because I fucking got an assist him. <laughs> what a stupid game. What a really stupid game. I mean, I've got to try and win against this guy, haven't I? He's fucking terrible. I've got to try to win. It's a shame that I wasted my wizard. Probably not going to get the one turn. I'm going to have to score on about turn four. And then somehow turn him over for the win. I haven't needed a reroll apart from the hit on the ball, so I guess I should have rerolled the hit on the ball now. <laughs> But it's just, I just don't understand it, man. I don't understand it. He just gave me the fucking ball and I just fucking failed. But I guess the wizard, the wizard was maybe a tilt wizard. Maybe I tilted a bit when I used the wizard, to be fair. It wasn't a great wizard and he was terrible and I was going to get a better chance to use it if I'd thought. Especially if I just conceded that I was going to be 1-0 down after this. Score early and then use the wizard to turn him over the 2-1. It was a bit of a frustration wizard, so... That's on me, to be fair. It was a frustration wizard. But, there's no point crying about it, just gotta try and fucking play better, haven't you? He's, uh, he's scored. He's given us a two turn try for no point. Of course, everyone stays out. Of course, they do. Jesus fuck, man. He's given us a two turn chance for no reason and everybody stays out. <laughs> fuck me. <laughs> what the fuck is this? What the fuck is this? <laughs> Just makes zero fucking sense, does it? Stay on the other ass. You can GFI at the end. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. You can get there without GFI. You could block him free. <laughs> Perfect. Perfect kick in the corner. Two, three, four, five, six. I don't know, I can just go there and make a fucking cage. Fuck it, sideline cage. I like tagging him. But sideline caging it is the next best thing, I guess. Ce 
le joueur est clairement le meilleur choix pour cette action. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six. And I think I've got to make a GFI with him as well. GFI, lob it, catch it, score. Piece of piss. One, one, then go for the win. It's possible. Possible to still win this game. It's just tough, isn't it? It's just tough mentally when someone someone can just do the things he's done and then ride Ash and wasted the wizard. It was a stupid wizard. It was a stupid wizard. Got no one but myself to blame for the wizard. served him. Wouldn't have done anyway. <laughs> Go to bed and hope he comes through. Looks like some chaos came back at least. Two. So the question is whether to take the die or win. Or push for the loss. <laughs> He's so bad. <laughs> but then I've lost to somebody bad already, so. Many a time I've lost to people who were bad. So maybe I should just take the die or win. If I can. I guess I want to get forward quick to give us the option in case I make some cars like that can happen. In the fantasy land of making cars. Yeah, it's a funny old game, isn't it, Blood Bowl? Because, like, nobody's really good, you know, like, nobody's, like, 
nobody's like Magnus Carlsen good at it or anything. So it's not like, you know, don't get me wrong with this, uh, with this comparison here. But <laughs> let's imagine for a moment that there were actually good people who were good at Blood Bowl. <laughs> right? In this fantasy land of people who are good at Blood Bowl, right? If you were to play a million frames against Ronnie O'Sullivan, you would not win a frame. <laughs> if you were to if you were to fight a million rounds with Tyson Fury, not only would you never win a round, you probably wouldn't land once. <laughs> um, <laughs> and if you did, he wouldn't feel it. And then, uh, if you were to play a million games of tennis with Nadal, you wouldn't win a point. <laughs> but, um, if you were to play... <laughs> no, no, but I mean, if, you, if it was possible to. Um... But you could play, you could play fucking Phil Ivy and beat him a decent amount of the time, couldn't you? Like you could literally beat, you could literally beat Phil Ivy, heads up, a decent amount of the time. Like what, twenty percent of the time, something like that. Wouldn't even be bad. You'd have a pretty decent shot at beating Phil Ivy. In a game. We beat him a decent amount of the time, provided your provided your strategy was go all in every hand. Yeah, exactly. He wouldn't need to double fault, would he? Like bar, bar barring a <laughs> like playing a million rounds of blood ball. Yeah, and Phil Ivey's fucking elite at at at. At uh, poker, isn't he? You can't get much better than Phil Ivey, or whoever the little kid is now. I'm sure there's some little kid that people think is better than Phil Ivey. Whichever little kid that people think is better than Phil Ivey nowadays. You beat him like 20% or something. You could play like shit though, because you'd just be going all in every hand, which is about as shit as it is. Yeah, you'd lose money, but you would still beat him sometimes. You would still beat him some like that's the thing, you can give yourself a good shot of being the greatest of all time, who's dedicated his life to it, who's fucking completely fucking amazing. Yeah, Negrano, there you go. You'd beat Negrano twenty percent of the time, ish or whatever, just by going all in every hand. <laughs> Which is <laughs> to all intents and purposes in blood in poker, playing like a complete fucking tool bag idiot, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> but at least it would be the right thing to do. It's still not. It, maybe it is the right thing to do. Maybe that's the right thing to do in Blood Bowl. Just give you give people infinite shots on your ball carrier, and hope it somehow magically works. Maybe Space Cadet has got it right. That's how you beat people who are better than you. Just literally let them hit the ball as much as they want, and it will somehow work out. It doesn't seem to be like me. It doesn't seem to me to be the equivalent of uh, going all in every hand, but maybe it is. Maybe it is the right thing for them. Yeah, because you'd be taking all the you'd be taking all the blinds, right? So you would. Um, so you'd only have to win one hand against him, and the best hands you could get is aces, right? So, and you'd only have to win one hand to win the game against him. It's just frustrating that someone can play this fucking bad. Yeah, I could probably only beat Phil Ivey in one percent effort fighting. That's probably the only way I could beat him, right? If I try, if I just tried to outplay him, he'd beat me. <laughs> But to me, playing like Space Cadet isn't the same as going all in. Like, I can understand going high risk, high reward, and that should pay off against people who are better than you, but he, he's, this guy's a fucking tool bag, he's an idiot.
<laughs> like these are just objectively terrible. <laughs> If Phil Ivey calls with a fifty-one percent best hand, then he's gonna he's gonna not win that often, is he? <laughs> Against you, of course you can. Nick. But like that's a strategy to beat him. Like that's the thing you've actually got to do a strategy. Like there's a strategy to beat the better player in poker, isn't there? This doesn't seem like it should be the strategy to beat the better player in Blood Bowl. Let your ball carrier get hit every turn. Multiple GFIs for no reason. Just constant shit play. Doesn't seem like it should be the way to beat people who are better than you. So that's what that's what makes it frustrating. At least there is a there's like a proper way. Do you know what I mean? Like in in poker, there's a proper way to play when you're disadvantaged. It seems to fucking work for them though, doesn't it? Look at Space Cadet's record versus me. 6-2 fucking 1, he batters me. He batters me all over every time we fucking play. It's never even close against Space Cadet. He just fucking ruins me. He just fucking ruins me. <laughs> he fucking... <laughs> every time Space Cadet just fucking ruins me. <laughs> Good afternoon, Scotty. Might be 11 or Glorious. 2. No, I won't give in. Until I'm victorious. And I will defend. I will defend. Oh, glorious. Thank you very much, Scott. That's Scotty's. Welcome to Team Fantastic. Oh, yeah. Yeah, maybe that's what it is. Maybe he's just a few levels above me, and, and, and what I can't see on those levels is not protecting the ball at all and making sure every block you roll is a pow and every pow is a removal, and that's it. I did get Mopey. I think the thing that I think the big thing though was the uh, was the bad wizard, right? Because if I still had a wizard here, pushing for the win would be a lot more sensible. If you want to be part of Team Positive, then uh, you've got to fucking suck it up, stop bitching like a little baby, and try and fucking play better, eh? Yeah, yeah, Sparta Smith, maybe that's it. Maybe that it's that simple. <laughs> I'm not tilted against him. Where's my tackler gone? Is he, is he removed another player? Oh, there's a player there anyway. Fuck. Let me tackle the fucking dead. Is he? Oh, yeah, of course he removed the tackler. Right. So I gotta power him, but then he's got tackle, so it's better to dodge through that other guy. But then I could just re-roll. Oh no, I've got to go through there anyway because of this dead body. No, but then if I power him, then I don't. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I can commit a re-roll to it, can't I?
double G a fighter hit. Fight to get there. Punch him first. Yeah, I, I, my fireball was done in this game, to be fair. I could have still had a I could have still had a wizard, and four turns no three turns to turn him over and win two one. I mean, I have mostly been down TV against Space Cadet, but still. That's the question, isn't it? I want to go for a win, just because he's terrible. But on the other hand, I, I might not have the tackler. And I don't have a wizard. But on the other hand, I might not even have a choice. <laughs> right? Might not even have a choice. i got one fucking skink. Okay, two skinks. Not many sauras. Might not even have the choice. To stop. <laughs> yeah, I mean, rookie flings versus Norse, you're not going to do anything, are you? That was worth sticking in a reroll, wasn't it? Yeah, pushing for the win based on a 50-50 KO roll didn't seem very smart. I've got to keep my re-rolls, but on the other hand, what if I get a rando? What if I get a rando removal? Using a reroll on these blocks would be terrible though. Really terrible. But powering one of these and casting them, they're armor eight. Said they're armor eight. <laughs> no, I can't, I can't put it in. <sighs> Jesus. I <laughs> really need the KO rolls. <laughs> you can't! Well, he got the KO rolls. At least he got the KO rolls, that's something. That's nice. Did I shout cunt?
it's not so bad if as long as I know when it happens I can just uh, put it you know put it that it what it is it's ridiculous isn't it I can't even believe they've put it on the same level as bad words so fucking stupid like it's so ridiculous like it's not even in the same fucking dimension is it it's ridiculous Yeah, the plus one movement lizard had two chances to score a one turn in his first game, which was with movement, which was the team's first loss. And not only did he fail both one turn attempts, he also died on the second. So it was his second one turn attempt, but he had, he had, he had already failed one turn attempt. Yep, and they've put it on. They've put it on the same level as words you would literally never say. Like what the fuck? That's so dumb. Third loss in a row, this. <laughs> I knew he'd GFI to hit. <laughs> yeah, exactly, Calcium. I'm not your mate, mate. <laughs> Maybe I should have appled the KO on the tackle. Yeah, but I really shouldn't have wizarded. That was a real. That was a real bad whiz. It's not like I've played perfectly the last three games. But they've all been pretty fucking disappointing. <laughs> oh fuck's sake, Al. Don't be mean. <laughs> I'll ask you, bro.
Bénéficie de soutien. Découdre mano à mano, Bob. Pas pour ça. Il faut se rapprocher jusqu'à sentir la laine de l'adversaire et voir. Yeah, it's going terribly. It's going absolutely terribly. Oh shit, Pedro. Well, I hope you're okay. Taken so long as well. <coughs> End the turn for fuck's sake! End the fucking turn, man! Glorious. No, I won't give in. Until I'm victorious. What's the better need for I will here? defend. I will defend. <laughs> he fucking did! <laughs> pull back to blitz to get an extra shot at the ball is the one who are like doing the recovery or whatever or scoring or anything so but I guess I've just got to try and not lose that's the most important thing isn't it I can't believe he flew. Well, I mean, I can believe he flew over there. I guess I should have rerolled the 2D on him. Right, 
normal blood bowl today. No more blood bowl today. To be fair, I push in the wrong direction as well, so it's, it's all my fault. I played this shit. I did play, I did various things wrong. Should have kept the wizard. Should have pushed, should have pushed the, the other dwarf up. And then he could have pushed him back instead of forward. So, you know. Didn't, uh, did tilt a bit. There you go. So that's it. Fair enough, isn't it? This fall guy is good as it looks shit. It's like a fucking free to play game. Except that you gotta pay for it. And all the streamers are completely fucking unbearable wankers playing it. They're all fucking unbearable. Like I would like to stab them all in the fucking eye. <laughs> unbearable. <laughs> Sorry, and ruins. But the ones that were all right, you know, there's a uh, who's it? What's he called? The one who does like uh, fucking shooting games. He sh he's good at clicking on people's heads. What? Who's that guy? Summit One G. Summit One G. I quite like him. He plays that game and he turns into a fucking idiot. Oh my god. Horrendous. <sighs> oh, if it was free, I'd play it. Imagine having a fucking PlayStation now. Mm -hmm. Fucking losing to this guy. Fuck me. 11, 11 and 0 start down the fucking tubes. Instant fail. I can't believe I lost to this guy. No offence to him. <laughs> no offence to him. But, um... He did not protect the ball well, did he? But then I shouldn't have wizarded then. I was a really bad wizard. And I did tilt and uh, played pretty crap. So there you go. Made a few mistakes. Roll bad, but made a few mistakes. What can you do? Shouldn't have played. Didn't feel like playing. Wow, three games lost in a row for me. Terrible. Absolutely terrible. Three games lost in a row. Well, that's good, isn't it? Kind of wanna, kind of wanna keep playing now, but not today. Right, thanks for watching. Blah, 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 stay fantastic.